So I thought I'd shoot another video with another MSR stove. Again, it's uh, minus 25. I've already got the uh, bottle pumped and you can see how cold this is. My finger's sticking to it. It's, it's definitely cold out here. So this is a Firefly. Um, I haven't really used this one much. I've had it for years, but uh, we'll see how she lights. Again, it's about minus, I guess maybe a little warmer than the last video, minus 22 Celsius or so. So we'll see if we can get this thing going. Little primer up here. There's some fuel. That's probably quite a bit actually. I've had this stove for a long, long time. And haven't really used it a lot in the winter. But it's never let me down. A lot of people say the uh, new stoves, the uh, canister isobutane or so on, are, are good to use in the cold weather like this. No way. It'll work for a few moments and then your liquid fuel won't vaporize. It'll just essentially turn to liquid in your tank and you're screwed. Might have to pump this one a little bit more. The Firefly doesn't have the uh, big generator loop. So the whole body's got to warm up. But we'll see if we can't get her going. I'm going to pump this a little bit more. There we go, she's starting to kick now. So it's a little slower to light than the XGK and the Svea, but still no problem. Anyway, a couple minutes to get it going. The uh, old school MSR Firefly. Very reliable, very simple, and it just works. <laughs> 